Hey guys, welcome back to Come Again TV, the only place on YouTube where all geek culture collides. I'm Shannon, and today is my birthday. And my wife decided to surprise me with some of Dan Aykroyd's Crystal Head Vodka. Now, don't really talk much about alcohol on this channel, but this is Come Again TV, the only place where all geek culture collides and there is a huge geek culture around alcohol and one of the most popular alcohols at this time and most highly regarded is crystal head vodka and i have to say that i have not tried this yet uh, it is, it is a bit pricey. I have to say, it's a bit pricey. I know that I'm not sure exactly how much it is. Like I said, my wife surprised me with it. Um, but I do know it's pricey. Uh, but I just, I really love the look of this bottle. And once this is empty, this will go great with my Ghostbusters collection. I love the, the skull Back in the day when I was a teenager and in my early to mid 20s, I had a huge fascination with skulls. I like drawing skulls. I, I had skulls all over my poster or all over my uh, notebooks, posters, um, tattoos. If you can see there, uh, there, right there. All right. <laughs> but this looks awesome. And there's on the cork, Crystal Head Vodka with the logo. Very nice. Here on the bottom, Crystal Head Vodka. This is 750 milliliter, 40% alcohol. Very cool. I cannot wait to try this. Um, I may film my wife and I both trying it um, for the first time uh, later tonight. Right now she's in making my birthday steak. So here, this it comes with this. It came, the, it's an elastic band. Uh, it looks like it's got a bead or something on the end holding it together. But crystal head Vodka for the Creative Spirit, 12 International Gold Medals. Here we have distilled four times from the highest quality locally sourced Canadian corn. Silky smooth with a hint of sweetness and vanilla. Both vodkas are filtered through Herkimer Diamonds and blended with pristine Newfoundland water. Then over here we've got Crystal Head Aurora distilled five times from English wheat. Each bottle is unique due to the decor due to the decoration process. A crisp, drier and bolder vodka. Both vodkas are additive free and gluten free. Use your head, drink responsibly. Copyright 2020 Crystal Head. The bottle and design are registered trademarks of Globe Fill Incorporated. To the creative class, we are the purest and smoothest vodka made with creativity that provides inspiration to dream, build, and make. Unlike other vodka brands, we see the world differently without limitations. We catapult imagination into reality. Crystal Head Vodka, the skull bottle. Crystalheadvodka.com. So there's that. I'm going to set this to the side so that once this bottle's empty, I can just put it back on there and set it on my Ghostbusters, one of my Ghostbusters display shelves. So, anyway. As I said, I'm getting ready to eat some steak. 
but I will come back here in just a little bit. And film. <laughs> that would be my dog getting into something and my wife fighting with him. <laughs> but uh, I will be back here in a little bit and we'll film a taste test of Crystal Head Vodka. So here's the uh, birthday present that the wife and kids got for me today. It's Egon Spangler's Neutrona Wand. Pretty cool, it comes with a stand. And it comes with a hook. So that's attached to my belt. Alright guys, and we're back with our taste test of the Crystal Head Vodka. Got my beautiful wife Elizabeth here with me. It's just got a cork. We'll be serving it over ice. Set this down. Cheers. It's really smooth. Very slight hint of vanilla, but not a lot, a whole lot. I have not drank vodka in a very long time. How long has it been for you? A couple months. I'm more of a whiskey drinker. I'm sure this would be a lot better if it was chilled. But yeah, it's not, it doesn't have that strong aftertaste that most vodkas have. I could definitely get drunk on this. <laughs> so anyway, and you said it was, uh, what, 50 bucks? Yeah. For a bottle this size? It's down 50 right now. 750 milliliters, $50 US currency. So it's not cheap. <laughs> you just got eight bucks, I think. Yeah, yeah eight bucks. All right. So uh, if you haven't done so yet, give it a try. Um, I'd recommend it. Yeah. I like it. Won't be able to drink it all the time, but. Yes, Sally. Uh, if you want it chilled, there's a contact I would recommend for you. It's chilled. <laughs> so, anyway, I've been Shannon. This has been Elizabeth. And I'm nobody. And this has been Come Again TV, the only place on YouTube where all geek culture collides. Take care, geeks. Hi, everyone. I want to take a few minutes to tell you about my first book, which was just released. Jack the Ripper, The Man Behind the Blade, available now on Amazon, Barnes & Noble, and AuthorHouse.com. It's currently available in hardback and paperback format, and will soon be available in ebook and audiobook. Jack the Ripper, The Man Behind the Blade, contains 20 chapters of evidence I have gone through to present to you my theory as to the identity of the Ripper of Whitechapel. For over 130 years, Saucy Jack's identity has gone undiscovered until now. 
and he's the last person anyone would ever suspect. I've long held a fascination of Jack the Ripper, and because of this became intrigued by true crime. My first high school English paper back in 1998 was on the murders and the many suspects. Since then, I've siphoned through data in order to learn the savage monster's identity. My time as a psychology major in college and the multiple sociology classes I've taken has helped me to uncover the truth, and it's much stranger than people believe. Jack the Ripper, the man behind the blade, now available. Buy it today. If you enjoyed that video, make sure you hit the subscribe button right there so you stay up to date on all things geek culture. Also, go ahead and check out one of these two playlists on the side for more videos just like the one you just watched. I'm Shannon for Come Again TV, the only place on YouTube where all geek culture collides. Take care, geeks.